Starting over simplifies things to me, though. Like, it's like we got to eliminate stuff that we're trying to force, and it's just it's not working for whatever reason based on the personnel that we have. You gotta, I, and I kept saying it, too. Like, like Kendrick Bourne runs great in cuts. And every time he runs one, they hit him right in the chest with it. That should be run like six more times a game. Michael Harvin ran a skinny post in the in cut. And what did Aikman do? Hit him about 10 times a game on him. Ben Coates ran a little shimmy out. Boom. We bang it on. Because he did it well. Troy Brown. When Welker went on. Spot routes. Edelman. Return routes. Same thing Amendola. You find out what they do well and you do it. Gronkowski. Drag route versus play action. Suck up the backer. You know, they, they need that type of stuff that works for the individuals that they have out there. And if you're out there and you can't cover a man, then shoot, you got to play zone. But shake up the zone. Don't go cover four zone with 12-yard cushions. Go cover two. At least make it more difficult to throw it in that hole down the boundary between the safety and the corner that's rolled. Like, there's ways you can improve your, your coverage. Blocking schemes can be simplified. And that's just a simple saying, you know what? We're not going to throw that much. We're going to run the freaking ball. And put the damn quarterback under center more. Hell with the damn shotgun and the RPO crap. You're not running RPOs. You haven't run one since Green Bay. That was preseason. If you got to run three tight ends, then run three tight ends. For Christ, when you pick up eight yards on first down, don't start chucking it out of gun next two plays. There's ways you can get better and strip it down. So it's not like it's all for naught. I mean, you could ugly up and muddy up the game and win. Squeak out a win this week by just playing just a bland, ugly-ass game.